All right, we are all packed up. Ready to go? Oh, yeah. Ready to go. So we made it to Colorado. Eric's walking in place. <laughs> How are you doing, buddy? All right, guys, we are finally here at the lodge where we're going to be fishing. Look at that pond. And we're also going to be doing hunting around all these lands. I want you guys to see how beautiful this place is. There you go. I got it on record too. Nice. Show the camera. Thanks. There you go. There's a nice bass right there. Oh, oh, oh. I just got boiled on. You see that? I just got boiled on. Oh, my God. That's a nice one, bro. Oh yeah. my god! That is a nice bass, bro! I'm gonna grab the camera. That's a big one. Yeah, keep pressure on it. Uh, actually, I think the GoPro will do. Don't jump, baby. Don't jump. Don't jump, baby. Don't jump. I didn't get a good hook, hook set on her. Don't let her get in those weeds. I can't control her. Come on, baby. Big that is a nice bass, bro. Oh, Don't do it. Oh, there she is. Good, good. Get her, get her, get her. Ooh! That's a tin. No, that's, it's that's not. Gotta be close. Oh, I got a scale, bro. Show the camera. Show the camera. Look at that bass, oh, bro. That's nice. my best bass I've ever got. That's a big bass. That is a huge bass, Dude. bro. Are you on pounds? 2.47 kilos. Five point four four pounds. That's come on, dude. That's gotta be bigger than five. Dude, I know. Look, I can fit my fist in her mouth, dude. <laughs> Man, get this mouth on her, bro. Look at this. Look at this mouth on her. <laughs> oh, look at this. my fist. Let's put it back. There she goes. Oh, come on, baby. Don't get stuck there. There, there she goes. goes. Woo! Good catch, man. That's my best bass, bro. Right now. Oh, Eric, keep breathing. What are you doing? 
I don't know. I'm supposed to keep reeling. I thought I first. Wait, <laughs> he just got a bite on the same size. <laughs> what the? F keep reeling. <laughs> I didn't know. Well, guys, we are getting dressed for the hog hunt right now. We're going hog hunting. So the guy said we're going to get a good amount of hogs. We're getting ready right now. And he's going to come pick us up. So just going to get ready real quick. He's down. Yeah. Yeah, he's down. Actually, I think there's a gate behind you. Okay. There he is. There he is. Oh yeah. yeah pretty cool. Alive, brother. Check our surroundings. Make sure that there's no pigs out. Hey, pig Check, out. Check your surroundings. Go ahead, one and a half. Hey, show me. Yeah. That's it. That's a pretty one. Oh. Yeah, now he's got the death wobble. He's good. Hog down. It's just a death wobble. Yeah, dead. I'm just being careful, brother. Yeah, I know. I'm good. That's like, why you, you know how many run. times we shot him? That's why he couldn't run because his arm's out. Look at all these cows. <clears throat> Let me just make sure he's gone. Yeah, he's gone. Oh, he's done. Oh, watch out! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Get that oh, video, I think so. Oh my god. Oh man. Oh. Oh, he's twitching. I shit my pants, bro. Oh, he's twitching. <laughs> oh, goodness Christ. There's one right there. That's a heart shot. Yeah. That's like a, that looks like a, like a blade. Ooh. Yep. Swing it. One, two, three. Throw him up. All right, let's take a picture real quick. Though. He's one of those pale pigs. Yeah, pretty. Yeah. We've done a lot worse than touch a dead pig. Hog is down. Did you unload it? I think I dropped one. I think we dropped two. Alright, hold your fire. I got a hold of it. I dropped one. Dude. Okay, relax. Is that okay with you? Pretty sure I chopped one though. All right, so we just ran into a group of about, Casey, how many pigs? Probably 30 or 40. Oh my God. 30 or 40 pigs and they were quite a ways. So we just decided to shoot and see what we can make out. And we dropped two of them that were closer to us. We're good shooting guys. Oh, yeah. Sir. Oh yes. So Step loud. back Eric, Step back. Oh, they're still alive. Good shooting guys. Thank good, you. Oh. Good shot. What? Should I just finish He's looking up. Should I finish him? Uh, yeah, let me get you on video. Here, yeah, record it. Wait. Right behind the ear. Finish her off. There you go, she's done. Let's get up on the other one real quick. All right. There no. she is. Let's see about this one. Oh, this, this one's, one's dead. Hold her in the ear with the, with the rifle, Eric. She spit up blood, but let's just make sure. She's good to go. Yeah, he's dead. He's Hold done. this one up again real quick. He's done, oh, he's done, dude. He's done, yeah. All right, two more drop, boys. 
They would have slung it further this way. What's that right there? Hold up. No, nothing. It's gonna be hard to stop. Oh, oh, right there. There you are. Lucky dude. That's 300. Education, yeah. brother man. <laughs> Good job, bro. I'm gonna walk up this way. Okay. Check it out. Should I unload? Check it my out. Gun? I'm telling you, there's gotta be more dead hogs, bro. Should I unload? Uh, yeah, go ahead. Love you, brother. One. Go two. Let's get the other one. This one's mine. Tyler, you want to say what's up? Hey, man, it's how it's done. <laughs> hey, guys, if you guys want a good thermal hog hunting guide in Texas, you call Tyler at Blackland Outfitters. Tyler, what's your number? Number is 903-449-2773. This you guys guy have will it. get you on pigs. He's got a bunch of property he hunts and a bunch of hogs. And this right here is Casey, one of his guides. Awesome guys. All right, Tyler, can you tell us what you did here? Yeah, you just make a slit right here on the where the tendons go in. Okay. You slide the rope through. You have the other leg. You do that on both legs? Both legs. Just a regular knot. Just do a double knot. When the pressure gets put on there, it'll automatically tighten up. Some gloves, right? Yeah. I've never milked a cake. Cool. That's the back strap. Right That's it? Mm -hmm. It doesn't run all the way down? Yeah. Okay. Oh. I hope you didn't shoot through it. Nah, yeah, she looks like she's okay. I want to see where the bullet holes are on this thing. I yeah. want to know where I yeah. shot. Well, we got them all cleaned up and in the cooler. Came here, put some ice in it. packed up and ready to go everything is in the truck we just emptied out all the blood from the cooler all the water that was all blood and the hogs are nice and ice here's the some meat. good footage it's nice and under ice we just drained the blood we're gonna keep doing that leave it under ice and we're getting out we're on the way to the airport right now it's almost kind of messed up <laughs> Pat's a little bit of the Texas spirit. He kind of doesn't want to go home, but we got everything packed up and we are sadly ready to go back to LA. But um, I really don't want to leave this place. I don't either. But Texas was beautiful okay. and amazing. The people were great. The city was great. The countryside was great. Everything was just nothing to complain about. Nothing. So, sadly, See you guys back in LA. All right, guys, we are back in LA. Sadly, sadly back in LA. I was depressed on the whole damn plane ride over here, but <laughs> but we're back to our uh, our real life and our responsibilities here. Uh, we had an amazing time in Texas. We caught a bunch of bass. We killed some pigs. It was truly 
a blast. I want to give a big shout out to Blackland Outfitters because you guys are freaking amazing. Tyler and his guide Casey, we hunted with them. I was really iffy on which guide I wanted to hire, but I'm really happy I went with these guys because they're freaking awesome. I felt like I was really hunting with a group of friends. Really, really cool guys. Yeah. Eric killed his first pig. Yep, that was amazing. We got his bullet casing right here. <laughs> I wasn't able to recover mine, but it is what it is. Uh, like I said, Blackline Outfitters, they're amazing. I will leave their information in the description below. Check them out, reserve your hunt, and you'll have a blast if you're looking to get out to Texas. But uh, we will be filming a part two to this video where we'll be doing the catch and cook. So we're going to cook up some of the meat that we brought back. Big shout out to some of our friends that made that possible. Yep. Uh, that was freaking amazing. You know who you are. And please, if you like the video, Give it a thumbs up, share, subscribe so we can make these trips possible. We're going to try to get out a lot and film a bunch of videos for you guys. And hopefully we can grow this channel a little bit at a time. But um, to whoever watching, thank you so much for watching. And I hope you guys stay tuned because there's going to be many, many more videos to come. And we're really dedicated and we're really going to grind out these videos for you guys. So We love you. We thank you. And we hope you guys come along on any, every adventure of ours. Thank you so much, and we'll see you on the next one.